If you can't move, how the fuck you gotta move to do what you gotta do to elevate to the next level? Then motherfucker, you stagnated yourself, my nigga, for real. And then, nigga, you shoulda be in the fucking field. Because we need niggas who in the field who gonna stop the drilling. And we niggas in the field, nigga, who gonna stop the drilling. And we gon' need niggas in the field who gonna stop the killing. We gon' need niggas in the field to stop the fucking dealing. We need strong niggas who gonna stand up firm on a fucking business. Who ain't gonna fold, nigga, when the hand fucking get tempted. Indeed. Principles, morals, that's all I fucking know. Niggas got it embedded up in my fucking dome. I'm fucking free. I ain't got no shackles on my mental. I ain't gotta shoot a nigga with a fucking pistol. I shoot niggas with knowledge, wisdom, understanding. You understand me, nigga. This finna be a win me. Stop the acting, nigga. This ain't no motherfucking grand me. Huh, nigga. Man, I truly appreciate everybody that been locking in, tapping in, rocking out with the platform. Flocko Santana TV do it for all of y'all at the end of the day. It's all about the people. You know, it's all about y'all. I'm trying to get y'all some fire content, some inspirational content, some real content at the end of the day. Get y'all something that can help y'all better y'all lives, man. I ain't trying to just get y'all some foo foo and get y'all some little sent off content, you know what I'm saying, that have people, you know, thinking negative or anything like that. We trying to promote some positive thoughts and get that flowing, you know, through our thought patterns. But with that being said, you know, this whole uh, video right here mean a lot to me because, you know, I'm in the hood. I'm on the nine, south side of Chicago. You know what I'm saying? Line City, you know, passing out the blueprint. You know, and a lot of people might not know what the blueprint is, but the blueprint is a book that was developed to help brothers and sisters across the country, not just the country, but the whole world, you know, to live a positive and righteous life, to understand, you know, that we are all connected and that we all should live a productive lifestyle at the end of the day. You know, uh, that's what I was passing out to brothers and sisters because it's needed in our community. So I many brothers and sisters, you know, locked up in jail, they dying at an early age, you know, they out there uh, struggling, don't know where their next dollar coming from, they don't know uh, how they gonna make it, you know, uh, kids can't be kids no more, you know, it's, there's so much going on. The grandparents are living the young, you know, the young dying at a young age, and at the end of the day, you know, somebody has to step up and let brothers and sisters know that you don't have to live like this. You don't have to be like this. You don't have to thug like this. You don't have to jug like this. You ain't got to trap like this. It's another way of living that's positive and productive. And you can still have fun. You still can have a, 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 a turned up lifestyle, but it could be a positive and righteous uh, lifestyle that you live in. And they don't have a have to have the consequences of you ending up dead in a box or you ending up in a jail cell, you know, and things of that nature. So that's the whole uh, thing that I want to present to everybody is the blueprint. You know, this not just for one certain uh, people, just for everybody, because this is the blueprint of life. This is what everybody needs so they can elevate to the next level in a life. Life is about living. It's not about killing. Life is about living. It's not about dealing. I want everybody to understand that we are all connected at the end of the day. You know, we are all responsible for what's going on in our communities. We are all re responsible for everything that's going on. The police can't come in, uh, come in our communities and clean it up. Can't nobody help our communities but us. And with that being said, I appreciate everybody tapping in, listening to what I'm saying right now. Spread the word. Let your people know. Flaco Santana TV. Go ahead, subscribe. Pass it to the right. Cause that's what the business is at the end of the day, staying positive and productive. And that's what I'm promoting on this channel. And that's what I want brothers and sisters to understand. That it's another way of life other than being on that block, trapping and doing the things you're doing. Check this footage out. Link up. Love.
Damn, they stressed out up here, boy. Damn. It's another nigga stretched down there, too. Yeah, somebody else there, down there. He in the car. He in the car dead, bro. Damn, they got these people stretched the fuck out, boy. Damn. Damn, they just fucked these people up, boy. Another nigga dead in the car down there too. Damn, they just fucked them boys up. Damn, they got them boys stretched the fuck out. Oh my mama. It's like four day ass check right now. Fuck, look, they stretched out, gang. Oh my God. He fucked up right there. Damn. This on the nine on Cottage Gold on 79th. Damn, he stretched out. What? It's Hey, what's good, my dudes? How y'all doing, man? Hey, yo. I, hey, bro. I'm out here just uh, pushing growth and development, telling bro that they could change their life at the end growth of the day. Yeah, it don't matter what you is, though. I'm gonna get the same. All right, that's the business. You see what it say right here, right? You see what it say. That's the business. You got them hey, 6.5 hey, on you. Hey, That's the business. My name is Flocko G. I'm from 103rd. You feel me? I'm out here pushing. 103rd period from College to Hostel. You feel me, Hostel, my dude? You feel me? I'm from the trade. Check it out. Go ahead. That's the business right there. I teach the blueprint classes. You feel me? So if you're interested in my dude, my name Flock OG. You know what I'm saying? Uh, fuck with me. I'm being a top pack myself, boy. Yeah. Man. I can't even go downtown. They got a motherfucker jammed up. You interested in it, my dude? Of course. Yeah. Why wouldn't I be? There you go. That's the shit I like to hear right there. But this a book you wrote? This the book from the old man. Right. Yeah, the blueprint, G. Look. This the book from the old man. Yeah, folks. Look, look. Check this out, folks. GD, we GDs, folks. Look at this. What this say? What's that? What's that, folks? Come on, folks. Come on, G. I'm out here trying to say, bro, the chain goes. We, we started off with the creed, but it, it, it just, we that, believe in the teaching of our honorable chair. That's yeah, it. It's the whole thing in there. It's the whole thing. But look, check this out. I want you to have one, folks. They're going to fuck it with you. I want, I want you to have one. Check it out, folks. <laughs> read it, folks. Read it, G. Look, check this out, though. All the little bros in the hood, folks. Anybody, G, who wants something to do with this, folks, I'm a bitch, bitch, bro. This is right here, folks. I'm not airing out for the motherfucker rap a lot of kids, my dude. Like, I just dropped that motherfucking Ruger shit with the GDs and the dope shit. My boy on YouTube, go look at that shit. My little shorty be rapping, too. We got that GDN video. Name What's Devo, the name? Ram M. Devo. I know, folks. Ask that's folks my, about, ask, ask folks about Flacco. That's what always rapping about. Ghetto. I'm ghetto. E, that's the business, that's folks. That's my rabbit. That's my little bro, folks. Okay. That's the business. I <laughs> follow folks. Heavy duty, my dude. That's my nigga. My little bro. Yeah. That's the business, G. Well, I'm finna motherfucker move around, folks. I love, yeah, folks. Okay. You already know. That, see that big ass star, David. On White. Yeah, that G. Bitch, that bitch ain't definitely. That, that bitch ain't there for nothing. Okay, GDN. 
GD, folk. When you in the hood, that's what I be talking about. Now, I hope everybody understand why Flocko do what Flocko do at the end of the day. Because when you're really from the hood, you're really from the trenches, you really see the poverty, you really see, you know, what's going on in the streets, that you really uh, know what must be done, you know, you're going to do what needs to be done. And this is what had to be done. I had to hit them blocks, had to hit them streets and let brothers and sisters know that they can grow and develop themselves and be whoever they want to be at the end of the day. The same block that I'm passing the blueprint on is the same block that you seen them brothers laid out on the ground, shot broad daylight dead on the corner, on the block. So at the end of the day, I want to say rest in peace to all the people that died over there in Lawn City on the nine. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to all y'all brothers that supported me over there. And everybody link up with me. I got some fire content coming. Let's get it.